Only you can smoke crack with a fat man. What's up, bros? We're back like seven minutes after oh the last video we did. <laughs> so, Holy shit. But we just got so much stuff, we had to try to cram it Camera. all in today. Because we'll have more stuff next week and the week after that. So we've got to try to crank them out as fast as we I'm can. Sorry, I wasn't listening. What are we cramming in where? We're cramming something in you later. Okay. <laughs> One getting near that thing right now. Ooh, <laughs> lunch is kicking back. Ren and Stimpy. Yeah, these were kind of hot a couple weeks ago. Everybody was talking about them, and it took us a little while to get them. I've been sitting on them for a week or two. But I loved Ren and Stimpy growing up. I had a fucking VHS tape with like four hours of Ren and Stimpy on it. And I just watched that shit over because we didn't have cable. That explains so much. We didn't have cable, man. I lived in the country. I had like three channels. Fucking shit sucked. Fucking so poor people. There was nothing better to do. Fucking poor people. Fucking, they didn't have, dude, these motherfuckers in my town growing up, they didn't have MTV in their cable plan. So, like, them kids never had. And we got satellite dish really good. But, uh, no, I love these guys. I just thought they were funny as hell. I watched Skinamax and all kinds of shit. They had all kinds of adult undertones so, like, older people could watch it too and they're just funny characters and I used to love the artwork where it would be, like, normal like this. And then it would be all fucking gross yeah, and nasty. Yeah, like, all super detailed, like, fucking... Hairs and boogers and wrinkles. And 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 like, when his teeth fall out and he's got, like, the stink coming out of his teeth holes. Yeah. That's <laughs> fucking awesome. <laughs> that shit was cool as fuck. Man. Yeah, it was a nasty ass <laughs> show. But it's basically Ren and Stimpy, and Stimpy's got some boogers, and they got Muddy Mudskipper with them. Ooh. So and he's got a song and all kinds of shit. But they also, I got another little package, but we're, those are, they're kind of just like mini statues or Maybe you can tell Togro Matt, like, we want to see those, so put them on Facebook. Okay, I will. Punk ass bitch. But Ren, you can squeeze them, and his eyeballs pop out. <laughs> and Ren's a dickhead, basically. And Stimpy's a bobble booty instead of a bobble head. <laughs> bubble butt. And they bubble got bubble little bubble stuffed butt. animals bubble too. Bubble 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 butt. I just thought it was cool that they were like, look at that booty guys back in the limelight. <laughs> little stuffed dudes. And like I said, there's also like little mystery boxes for like Rugrats and Ren and Stimpy. I don't watch Rugrats. You're but, a fucking liar. No, I didn't really. I watched um, Rugrats. But yeah, they're bringing all these Doug guys back. Too. Remember so Patty Mayonnaise? That'd be awesome if Ren and Stimpy came back, but not that stupid Spike TV fucking remake shit. That shit was lame. <laughs> fucking, they, they went like too... You want to show off your little dude you have here yeah, too? Yeah, I got the little kid robot adult swim mystery minis. I got early Kyler, which you guys probably don't know, but I'm like a hardcore Squidbillies fan. I love that show, and it sucks that... They don't have any new episodes, but <clears throat> I got a shitload of likes on that picture. Just some little dumb kid robot dude. But hopefully they'll do Rusty and Granny and the Sheriff and all, like Dan Hale and all the different characters. Because that shit's fucking hilarious. You ever watch Squid Billies? Yeah. Fucking, like, it's so stupid it's fucking funny as hell. <laughs> My favorite one is when uh, Rusty gets the fucking gets possessed by the devil to play music and he's in there fucking the priest goes and he's like the power of Christ compels and he's like splashing like a sippy cup he's got a or the sheriff's got a big like two liter fucking cup from the gas station and he's like the power of Christ compels and he's splashing on him and the priest goes in there he's like I'm gonna get the devil out of him and he fucking starts playing like this badass solo and like this monster ballad and fucking he comes out they walk in and the priest has got a rusty t-shirt and like, yeah. he's like yeah. He's fucking, <laughs> that show is fucking awesome. Then early talking about Rusty's trying to learn how to read. He's like, ain't nobody never learned no, no damn good from no damn book. He's like, it ain't never not gonna will. <laughs> fucking, it's so stupid, but it's awesome. Really good show. So we get on to the main event? Yeah, fucking... What we were talking about in our last video was I ordered the quarter scale Michelangelo, which I told you guys I was getting it, and like you notice... 
I did not get this until the other day. I paid for it August 26th from this website called Everything for Less. And I messaged them like September 26th. So I was like, dude, it's been like 30 fucking days and I still don't have like... I got a confirmation, but I didn't get any shipping or anything like that. So <clears throat> I messaged them and they're like, oh, you didn't get your item? And they're like, what's the item number? I gave it to them and they're like, here's your refund. I was like... <laughs> for real like what the fuck what if I didn't get this you know what I'm saying that I have three fucking ninja turtles <laughs> yeah right and not the fucking last one the, like the most important one fucking it was just kind of shady I, and I found out that the dude was on Facebook and he was in one of the groups as like a normal person so it's like his website but I just didn't find that to be very professional like what, definitely like, not man what is that like here's your refund what if I ordered like a Mezco Deadpool or something that started out at 75 bucks and then two months later I'm getting it and it, I gotta pay like 150 for it you know what I'm saying that's kind of it just I it's very weird like I don't know I never had any problems ordering stuff online what was it called everything for less everything for less you guys so, fucking suck yeah if you have an experience <laughs> like that I guess I warned you but um you know lo and behold I got my money back but it could have been a shitty situation because they only had two of these I actually had to pay fifteen dollars more than what I would have. The lesson so, is, don't fuck over people you sell shit to, because you never know they might have a fucking YouTube channel and put your ass on blast. Yeah, now you <laughs> see what I'm saying with like ordering stuff online. I always end up something gets fucked up, and like YouTube stuff is crucial. Like we got our fan base, but if we want to attract new fans, yeah, we gotta get we stuff. Have to have current things. We have to have a current and, like getting it two months after it comes out that's, that's like what right. he was talking about in the last video about the deadpool the new one that's mm -hmm. just came out in california by the time we get it here in florida y'all yeah. yeah, are gonna want to watch a review i mean our fans will you the guys that love us and because bros, like know, we always say it ain't been reviewed until the toy bros reviewed it and you know we hate scalping so i don't want to pay 56 70 dollars to get a figure a couple weeks before it's actually supposed to be out. So I think what those are, they're street dated for the 1st of November, and it's people that got their boys at GameStop and shit hooking them up because they got them in stock. They're just not supposed to be on the shelves. Right. So how else are they fucking getting them? You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Well, we're going to crack this boy open, and but we'll have him out here in a second. I'm not jelly. I'm not salty. I just want my fucking dead food. And you're ugly and sweaty. Shut up, asshole. Michelangelo! Thank you guys. So we finally got the last one. And like I said, it wouldn't be complete if, if you only got one of the turtles. What the fuck? Well, we got Michelangelo and I think he's on drugs. Yeah, he's Look at his fucking eyeballs. eyeballs. Looks like he's been up all night doing like an ball. Hey! You can actually make him like Chuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! yeah I, I can do that better with him than I can in real life. <laughs> I always just end up hitting myself in the nuts. I got the little rubber ones from the Dollar Tree and they, I still fuck myself yeah, up with those. Yeah, they're good for practice, but... They do like to fall down, though. My buddy Paul asked me one time long, he's like, you know how to use those? And I was like, yeah. And I was like, clunk. <laughs> Fuck, hit me right there. Toy Roadmap's lying. He doesn't have wood. any friends. <laughs> you're right. You're right about that. <laughs> I'm so depressed. <laughs> I love you, Toy Bro Matt. No. All I do is talk to cats and play with toys. Toy Bro Matt has good quality. He's an excellent bargain shopper. He got that G.I. Joe shirt for fucking $3. $3 dog. What kind of fucking chick doesn't like an excellent bargain hunter? That's right. Fucking, I'm not in the camera again. Why are you That's fucking keep touching this shit? We need a camera. I didn't even touch it. You we need a new camera. Like, we had, like, yeah. some good... That was my phone. And that shit did look good. We'll figure out. How we to just do need the to make it bigger, right, but, but we just want to get a badass 4K camera yeah, for you guys because it really does do the figures justice. Like you can just see so much cleaner detail on them and stuff. Yeah. So it that's gonna be our next step once I get the extra money. Just trying to find my computer guy to fucking help me fucking. We was also thinking about renting. One. We might rent like an air conditioned storage unit and make a Toy Bro studio until we, I can get in a place and we can make a permanent. But one. But we because so. we could get a little tiny one and pay shit a month for it and split it and it'd be yeah, fine. I really want you guys to see my collection. Like I'm not just talking get a shit. PO, like, we need to get a PO, a PO box. Somebody was saying that the other day. We need to get a PO box. Yeah, they wanted to mail us something. They want to mail us some shit. A severed penis or something. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> kind of weird, but I was hoping for toys. No, first. Michelangelo. <laughs> he had pork rinds. Yeah, he comes. He's the only one that comes with like the other one's got the ooze containers. And it's like it's almost but, a real bag of pork rinds like here. He's got some fucking pork rinds and pizza with them. Like yeah, that. and we he so, just and it's like it just conveniently goes right there. <laughs> and 
Rob likes to put his pizza in his belt. And his pizza goes in a belt. Where else if, do you keep pizza? Is this just like, is? I don't know if you guys, how well you can see that, but it's a half a pizza. So does that tell us like things to come? Is there going to be another half? D- d- what are they going to do? Well, because they got Shredder. Shredder. He's not going to come with pizza. They got Shredder, the foot soldier. Sh- tell Toy Bro Man to shut the fuck up. They're supposed to be doing Casey Jones. And then they got the Raph in disguise, which I think is bullshit because it's just. I Raphael think we should get some jacket. little Nikki figures and get a bucket of chicken. Or Popeye's chicken is this? <laughs> She's nasty. I don't know where the fuck that came from, but I was just talking about little Nikki the other day. I always talk about that shit. That's a good. That's a good. That's a good I love one. little Nikki. Adam I love Sandler. Adam Sandler. Period. He's got some gems. <laughs> he got some gems. But yeah. Happy still, Gilmore. Because we finally got Mikey, and like I said, I've seen people getting like some really good poses out of these. Like on Facebook and shit. I don't know how the fuck they're oh, doing God, it. God, Toy Romance gonna snap his fucking <laughs> leg so, off. It's so scary when you're dealing with NECA and nothing against them. It's just how things and end And I up. think the Toy Bros, in order to get a good picture, we're probably gonna go rip a manhole cover off of somewhere and yeah. probably risk getting thrown in jail for the night. Trespass. So. We're gonna start a GoFundMe for bail money for Toy Bro Mac. Yeah. <laughs> Toy Bro Mac got caught. Fucking please be. Go the ahead, shit whip out him out. I know you fucking want to. Oh, I've been dying. Fucking I gotta get try to get all four brothers in the frame. Jesus. I was like, why don't you just take a picture and put it on Facebook and then so everybody them, has to go look at Facebook. And tell them, go on our Facebook if you want to see pictures. Yeah, go look at Toy Bros on Facebook and you guys don't have to search if y'all are in, if y'all are perverted and retarded like us. There is a Toy Bros X where you can pretty much post anything you want on there. It's yeah. our little group. And then we have our page, which is different. We both have Instagrams. Uh, Toy Bro Rob, Toy Bro Matt. They're really yeah, under, it's Toy Bro. Link should be in the description if you want to go to it's those like pages. All underscore between the words. Like our external sites. We don't have a real website. We just have our Facebook page. And that's how we get a hold of you guys. It's a little bit easier than YouTube. If you do want to talk to us or send us a message or ask us but a question, th- we got all. There's all kinds of Toy Bro Can't shit floating around out now. there. That, that's a fucking good thing. But yeah, that's all the turtles, and they look awesome. We to finally do. have them all. Yeah. Like you seen a dude? You seen that dude? that has got like, a really badass diorama. That's like a brick wall, with a sewer hole, and shit. Yeah, I know. I some, pretty sick. Somebody I know is supposed to make me a brick, brick wall diorama. Fucking, Fucking shut up. toy bro. I, I'm a procrastinator. Gay ass Matt. I procrastinate. I say I'm, I was gonna do a brick wall, but I masturbated instead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we all know. We all know that to be true. I love this Leonardo swords because Leonardo's like my favorite because yeah. he's the leader. And I'm a leader, and Toy Bro Matt is a follower. Some dude did, like, some extensive, like, custom on how to, like, make his sword sheath shorter. And I was like, why don't you just, like, cut that off? <laughs> yeah, like, blueprints he drew up for that shit. I was like, whoa, bro, you're getting a little too in-depth there. Right? I'll take some fucking tin snips and cut <laughs> that shit off and be snip. like, ta-da! Like, there you go. <laughs> Looks good. But, uh, yeah, I'm thinking that, uh, let me zoom in on it. Look at Michelangelo's eyes compared to all the other yeah. ones. He definitely got... Mikey got mixed up with the wrong crowd. He's always looking for Sudafed for some reason. <laughs> Bro, I can only buy two boxes at a time. Can you go in there and buy me some Sudafed? I'll give you 20 bucks. And then Donnie looks like cold. he's getting ready to scratch himself. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, they did a good job of getting the likenesses of the turtles. Oh, dude, these are amazing figures, and I'm really excited to see them. Like, really, they come out with, like, a... A shredder, a splinter, a takar, a razor. Oh, that'd be so awesome. Oh, man. Especially with the way they have those Casey dudes. Jones. <laughs> yep. And maybe an April O'Neil with a fat ass. Ooh. Like woo. 80s chick. Don't even do that. You can crimp I don't think shit. you should be allowed to have a female yourself. action figure man, as big as them right there. right there. Yeah, but, you know. <laughs> Why is that thing? Why is it sticky? Yo, did you see Kryptonite's new stickers? Yeah. Oh, look. Check that shit out. Oh. That's from Sweet Leaf Tobacco and Vapor Shop. Kids, don't do drugs or smoke cigarettes. It's but if you do, go to Sweet Leaf. But check out the fucking stickers. <laughs> that shit's badass, ain't it? <laughs> Chris will be happy about that. You better give us some love, bitch. Yeah, yeah. Be our sponsor. <laughs> it's don't watch our videos. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, that's the turtles, dudes. Fucking fuck yeah. All right, well. Get these guys out in the field and take a picture of them touching each other's butts. Well, they're fighting, I mean. 
fighting. Yeah. They're when they're sparring. In the I, yeah, barn. That'd be a cool get a. Uh, we could get a picture of that again, like uh, try and remake that scene in the movie. Yeah, yeah. Because the dude did it with those older tur- the little turtles that we did, like the Playmates ones that they re-released that were supposed to be movie turtles, but they didn't have. Like, I think the, they should remake the Ninja they didn't Turtles. Have the texture or anything. And the Karate Kid. Ninja Turtles meet Karate Kid meet three ninjas. Meet critters. <laughs> Versus the critters. Versus critters. God damn it. <laughs> out of here again. It's getting 1980s up in here. <laughs> Those movies were the best, though. They fucking, they used real shit The back movie, then. the Ninja Turtle movie that these were from is the best. Yeah, like, those new ones, they fucking They're, suck. They don't suck. Compared to these, they do. They're good. Because this they're was the good. best, though. Hands down, I think a lot of y'all out there agree that we're around in that time frame, and then all you millennials can suck my asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I think we are millennials. I'm not a fucking millennial. I think, I think it's like 1983. Yeah, well, I ain't no... <laughs> I'm definitely not in that category. before the year 2000. Nah, I'm just millennial. playing. You guys are all right, because yeah. most of y'all are my friends. <laughs> yeah. You put everybody's, up with me. Everybody's got a little douchebag in them. <laughs> Except right. for Matt's boyfriend, he's a big douchebag. Hey, shut up. <laughs> Talk about my boyfriend. <laughs> I'm not gay, guys. I'm totally honest. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's like, fuck, fuck, fuck. How do I get out of this? <laughs> I keep digging this hole deeper and deeper. All right, guys. Well, I think that's it for this video. Yeah, I think we've rambled on. Twitter, Rob's got to poop. I got to go home and poop because I worked all day and then came hey, over here and shot hey, this video. Rob's taking a shit. Hell yeah. <laughs> and I got some badass soft toilet paper I'm going to go home and use the shit out of because it feels nice. 30 minutes to get home, so good luck, I know, buddy. fuck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Look. Look. Until Look. next time, guys. Yeah. Throw a romance out. <laughs> so gay. <laughs> get the fuck out of my house, bitch. All right.